Temple of the Golden Cricket. Every 50 years at sundown, the Golden Cricket emerges, singing its ethereal song. Some say the song holds the answer to life's greatest mysteries. How did we get here? What's our purpose in the universe? Wait, is that a neon hot dog? Whoa. So cool! I'm hungry! Yes, yes, the city of Macaw is very exciting to look at, but you'll only find empty distractions there. I can't believe Uncle Gladstone is here! He's so charming! And funny! He's like the luckiest guy in the world! Ugh, Uncle Donald, you must have had the best time growing up with him! Hey, twenty dollars! Hey, twenty dollars! Hey, twenty! What? He's the worst. Just the worst. Gladstone Gander is a complete layabout. I don't know why we're responding to his call. It was a call for help. And like Uncle Donald says, family always helps family. Why did I say that? Plus, he's easily our coolest uncle. Hi. Sorry, coolest non-trillionaire uncle. <laughs> hey, come on, Uncle Donald is kind of cool. <laughs> for the temple in an hour, Launchpad. I won't wait another 50 years to hear that cricket sing. Sure thing, Mr. McD. I was just gonna swing over and visit an old girlfriend from these parts. See, she's had some problems with the local crime family yes, and- Yes, fine, whatever. One hour! I'm coming for you, Ziggy. Why did I wear green? He always sees me in green. Yeah, if Gladstone's so great, then why did he call us for help? No! Don't stop! Until you get that last kink out, Pepe. Huh. <sighs> Loose as a goose and ready to gander. Kids, Uncle Scrooge! D-Money! Was so relaxed I didn't hear you come in. Pepe here is a miracle worker. Anyway, welcome to Macaw. Help yourself to everything. Guys, try this. It feels like you're falling, but you're not. Oh, I do need your help. Spending all my winnings. Oh, lighten up. Hey, hey, guys, who am I? Haggis and Topats, bless me bagpipes. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh, this place is for no account freeloaders looking to get something for nothing. Ah, that's true, Scroogey McBillions. And I am the best at getting something for nothing. Best of Thank you, Gladstone, for your inspiring message. If you'll excuse us, we have an improbably enchanted insect to inspect. To the temple! <laughs> yes, oh, yes. but I want to stay! Show me everything, especially the stuff you're not supposed to. <laughs> I love this kid! He's like me, but short and with a cheaper haircut. Now, you just gotta help me convince your Uncle Donald. 
Well, forget it then. Been nice seeing you, Uncle Gladstone. Wait, 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 D-Square. You came all the way out here. Let me show you guys around. It'll be good times. Fine, you can stay. Well, I can? And I'm coming with you. Mm. Come on, kids, let them play pie go with a bunch of biddies. We have a rip-roaring adventure awaiting us. Adventure! I can't make sense of this. Where's the exit? Is that X hidden treasure? The X is obviously where we are, but where are we? Don't worry, kids. I'll get us out of this monument to moochers, or my name is Scrooge McDuck. What good fortune to have the highest of high rollers in my humble establishment. Luck has nothing to do with it, Mr. Liu Hai. Toad Liu Hai, please be my personal guest. Anything you need, just let me know. At the House of Lucky Fortune, you are all kings. Oh, good. Street magic. Well, thank you, but we really must be going. At least stay for the floor show. Aquarium, the sacred waters of Aquarian. The biggest indoor water spectacle in the Eastern Hemisphere. Biggest waste of water is more like it. I mean, how many million gallons are you going through a day just for some dumb... In a time before time, the earth lies beneath the watery grave. There is only light. There is only ocean. And among all the primal chaos, there lives... Aquarium. Water dancing. A calm washing over me. Never felt so at peace. Well, I suppose we have time for one show. But then it's right to the Temple of the Golden Cricket. This is the best anyone has ever looked. Well, Green Bean, if you want to be a winner, you need to look like a winner. And you can build my suit to the room, please. Oh, no, 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 Mr. Gladstone. I cannot do this. It would be such a great honor for me to know that you are out in the world wearing this suit. $2,000. Cash only. Just like a real thing on the keeper. Oh, man. Uncle Donald's got to be the unluckiest duck in the world. I'm counting on it. And though noble Aquarium fell that day, his soul lives on. For we are all Aquarium. We should really stay for the 315 show. You'll always be with me, mighty Aquarian! Mr. Uh, Gander, thank you. Oh, you're so kind. I love it, baby. You're the best thing that's ever happened to me. Hey, where's Donald? <laughs> there he is. Try your luck, Mr. Gander. If I must. <laughs> How about you give it a go, Donaldo? Easy peasy. We've passed this gaming section like three times. Wait, didn't that gift shop used to be over here? Everything looks the same in this blasted place. They tried to trap you here. So you'll spend all your time and money on cheap thrills. But we're better than that. Yeah, we need some danger. Some... Tigers? Oh, where did you come from? And more importantly, did you say tigers? The majestic jade tigers of Macaw. Humanely raised in our natural wildlife pavilion and business center. Actual tigers? Do the number of stripes tell you their age? Is it true if you stare them in the eyes they won't kill you? Or does that make them want to kill you faster? Oh, would you like one? You can't give a child a tiger. Especially not this child. Dewey Jr., you're coming home with us. Oh, and I already named him. Oh, and I'm already super emotionally attached. Oh, fine. But I am not changing its litter. Now, about that exit. <laughs> that guy at the mall with the iguana is going to be so jealous. Give her a spin. Ha, 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 ha!
<laughs> Can't waste all the luck on me. Attention. The 315 performance of Aquarium, the sacred waters of Aquarium, has been canceled. Seven no. fingers. I don't know, Lou. I just don't know. I navigated myself out of the Infinitor's labyrinth, freed myself from the forever fields of Phantom. Why can't I find the blasted hotel exit? Oh, don't worry. I left a trail of snacks behind us to mark our path. He's a tiger. You tell him not to eat something. You look tired, Ugh. Mr. McDoc. I implore you to check into a room. My oh, no. We are not interested. At least stay for lunch. At our buffet of many lands. You can visit the entire world on a single dinner plate. Imagine taco dim sum, fettuccine eclairs. Why would I want to imagine any of that? Sorry, sir, but the only thing we're hungry for is adventure and is that a fountain made of chocolate? You can dip positively anything in it. Strawberries? Mm-hmm. What about my hand? Sure. What about your hand? Um, fine. Wait! What about the temple of the golden cricket? What about the mysteries of the universe? What about a nice warm bed? Fine, check me in. Ugh, give it up, Uncle Donald, please. No, 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 let it ride. You're about to... Two? We have a winner! Congratulations, you won a brand new Thunder Clutch sports car. <laughs> Great! This is the second car I've won for... Four? <laughs> you win again! Seriously? Wow, you really can't lose! Yeah, I know. So close, Big D. Hey, how about we play... No, I give up. I came to help you and extend your embarrassment in front of the boys. I'm not trying to embarrass you. I just wanted to give you and the fam a taste of the good life. That's why I'm a loser. <sighs> Winners, losers, who cares? If you want to impress them, keep playing. Your luck is bound to change. Hey, Uncle Gladstone! I'm done. Wait, no! Uncle Donald's taking a break, huh? Well, then this is the perfect time for us to hit the big winner's tables. I don't need you. I need him. You'll feel so much better after a night in one of our luxury suites. Maybe a week. Perhaps a year. You may never want to leave. I'll need a room with a personal sauna, poolside view, and a distraction. A what? Check-in is always by the exit. Thanks for the help, Blue High. Come on, kids. We can make it in time for the Golden Cricket's last chorus. I'm with you. Let's go. Where you going, cuz? There's tons more games. Oh, in the buffet. I did it. You did too, Uncle. I'm lost. I'm fine. Oh, dang. Did I not mention I'm a prisoner here and that's why I called you for help? What? Why didn't you just tell us? Because I'd find out. I am Liu Hai, ancient spirit of chance and fortune. Now. Let's test your luck. Finally, a proper adventure. <laughs> I sat through the waters of Aquanodon three times when I could have been fighting a demon. It's Aquarium? Mm. Uh, yeah, you don't want to mess with Toad. He's a luck vampire. He's held me captive here to feast off my natural good luck. I'm that delicious. Are you bragging about that? 
I hoped Donald would break my lucky streak. You know, because he's... Bad luck. A total jinx. The worst! Gladstone's good fortune has been satisfying. But surely, as the richest duck in the world, Scrooge McDuck's luck must be the most delicious feast of all. Luck has nothing to do with my success. Oh, really? I'll prove it. One game. If I win, you set us free. If you win, we stay. Permanently. Unless you think the spirit of luck and fortune will lose. Hmm. I can't resist such a challenge. Yes! Thank you, Screwdriver McDollar Signs. I knew I could count on you. Behold! First to the end wins. Okay, Toad, let's do this. Ah, ah, ah. My house, my rules. Gladstone still belongs to me, so he is my champion. You get... Mm. Yeah. The winner goes free. The loser is doomed. <laughs> I don't even get to be part of the blasted challenge! We came out here to help you, and you put a family in danger! I'm sorry, Don. I really am. But I literally just can't lose. Good luck. <laughs> There is only ocean, there is only light, and among the primal chaos, lives Aquarium! Sorry about this. I mean, obviously not sorry enough to sign up for a lifetime of servitude, but... I still have the luckiest buffet on Earth. Bad fortune, Mr. Gander. Actually, Toad, Gladstone lost to Donald. So technically, Donald is the new luckiest guy on Earth. It's really him you should take. Yeah! Well, no! Mmm, a well-reasoned argument. Donald Duck is my prize. That wasn't the deal! All bets are off. <laughs> Uncle Donald! I can't believe you just gave him up! 
The kid's not wrong, Uncle McDunkle. What do we do? Three, two, one. <laughs> it's luck. It's awful. So awful. So awful. You did it, Uncle Donald. You won. <laughs> that was pretty cool. I mean, especially for you. I guess you're not so lucky after all. Uh, if you think about it, we're all free. So, me losing is the luckiest thing that could have happened. Boom! Still the luckiest guy on Earth and a hero. Huh? Eh, luck's overrated. <sighs> Whoa, launch pad. What happened to you? Uh, you know, tourist stuff. Goodbye, Ziggy. Wherever you are. Have I really just been coasting on my luck, charm, and ridiculous good looks? Who is Gladstone? I need to get my hands dirty, do something meaningful, a new, noble purpose. Hey, handsome. I need to get rid of my boat for tax purposes. I'll sell it to you for $20. Gladstone is back, baby! Okay, we can go now.